Well, stop signs, parking signs, street signs, you've seen them all. There are 30,000 traffic signs in the city of Knoxville, and they're all created by one person. Shannon Smith introduces us to the man behind the signs. Behind every sign in this shop is Keith Black. What I do determines what you do. When you ask Keith to describe himself. What do you want to know about me? Um, really just one thing comes to mind. I'm just a sign geek, sign nerd. A fitting title for the man responsible for every single street sign you see in Knoxville. But if you actually looked and started counting, you would see that there are signs everywhere. And you make all of them? And I make I make all of them. Parking signs, stop signs, greenway signs, game day signs. This is one of my favorites because, well, fish. Keith is the architect behind them all, single-handedly making an average of 8,000 signs a year. What I do is viewed every day, thousands of people. They don't have a clue who made it, but they're still looking at it, you know? Keith and I have unknowingly crossed paths before when I did this story in 2020. Not all the road signs match. Most of them say Merchant Drive. The signs at the intersection with Clinton Highway say Merchant Road. About how all the Merchant Drive signs were wrong because no one knew the actual street name. Right, I remember that. that was my fault. No, you know, I'm the type of person that's like, thank you for catching that. When Keith makes or remakes a sign, he starts with a design that's sent to this nifty printer. I do use a lot of green. It's then covered with an anti-graffiti laminate. If the taxpayers were ever worried about how their money was spent, this is money well spent. Cut and attached to a metal sheet like a giant sticker. I've done this like 5,782 times. And he's never bored. I enjoy it. I love, I love what I do, you know. To some, Keith's job may seem mundane. To him, his influence stops traffic accidents and helps emergency workers. If my grandmother was down the end of the road and they couldn't read the sign, they couldn't get to her and she died, well, that's not right. And that falls on him. When they're there and functioning, nobody thinks about it. They're missing and something happens. It's like, oh my God, why don't we have a sign here? You know, they are very important. Which is why Keith keeps working, so that no matter where you live in the city, you don't have to look hard for a sign. I really love what I do. In Knoxville, I'm Shannon Smith. And Shannon said after she filmed the story, she tried to count how many street signs she saw on her 10 minute drive back to the news station <laughs> and already counted over 200. So try that yourself next time you drive your commute home from work or that's impressive. And what a contribution to your community. You can how see your work neat. everywhere, you know, goodness gracious.